everyone talking about amber oud by Killian. The notes in this are, according to Fragranica, amber, oud, bay leaf, cedar, and vanilla. I have a really hard time believing that that's the real notes. And I think some other people said too that even the Killian site doesn't reference oud actually being in this. Always really weird to me when a fragrance will use, you know, a note name in the title, but then it's not even actually in the thing. And it's not even like, oh, something like leather where that's not a real thing and everybody's creating an accord that just smells like it. No, like oud is a real note. So that's weird to call it that if it's not in there, but I certainly don't smell any oud. Yeah, to me, this smells, but it's really good. I like it a lot. Um, Smells like ambergris and rich dark chocolate in a really good way. I don't know if everybody would get that out of it. I didn't really see anybody else say the chocolate part, but that's totally what I'm getting out of it. Yeah, I wouldn't know there was oud in this at all if it wasn't in the title. And like I said, I'm skeptical that there even is. There's a slightly rubbery vibe that could be maybe going for an oud-like accord, but I am not an oud fan. And I don't even get well-behaved oud here, let alone, you know, deep, rich, pungent, or animalic or anything. But I think this smells so nice. Yum, welcoming and like, I would say probably mass appealing in a good way of like, you know, people thinking that you smell good around you, but also like refined and sexy at the same time. So it's not like watered down boring or something. Very unisex to my nose. Moderate to good longevity and projection. This is long discontinued. I think you'd have to check eBay or something for a bottle. I will link in the description though, where you can get a sample or decant. There's still a lot of great sample sites that have decants of this, including pretty big ones. So really, really good though. I'm definitely going to keep testing this further on skin, but I am liking this a lot so far, and I would say this is one of my favorite Killians that I've tried. Very unexpected from those notes. Also, because bay leaf can be very kind of like darkly aromatic, pungent and stuff, and cedar can be so dry. Like, I I don't think those notes can be right, but to me, I'm getting ambergris and sort of a chocolatey vibe, and I like it a lot. 